Jennifer Lopez and Ben Affleck were seen heading to their West Hollywood office to talk with divorce lawyer Laura Wasser on Monday morning. Laura, who was involved in Ben's separation from Jennifer Garner, is assisting the exes in mediating their tricky divorce, as reported by TMZ. Lopez and Affleck's difficult breakup is due to the fact that they did not have a prenuptial agreement when they said I do in August 2022. Their marriage lasted barely two years. In the time after their wedding, the actors collaborated on several films, including Unstoppable, Kiss of the Spider Woman, The Greatest Love Story Never Told, This Is Me Now, and others. Jennifer may be eligible for a share in Ben's production firm with longtime Matt Damon, which was founded after he wed the former Fly Girl, the most challenging aspect, according to the site. They both want the divorce to go well, so tensions won't rise. An anonymous insider told People on Monday that the couple wants to demonstrate to the children that they are cordial. A cordial relationship is something they would like to maintain. A great deal of affection remains. The fact that Ben and Jennifer appeared to be getting along when they brought their children to brunch at the Beverly Hills Hotel earlier this month suggests that the divorce is doing rather well. Entering the hotel, they strolled hand in hand. Page 6 stated that, unlike other couples going through a divorce, Ben could not resist touching and kissing Jen. But they've been apart for quite some time, they didn't even live together for the majority of this year. On the 20th of August, the 55-year-old singer-songwriter's second wedding anniversary, she filed for a divorce without legal representation. Legal documents reviewed by DailyMail.com reveal that Lopez named April 26, 2024, as the date of separation. According to sources close to the couple, they did not get into a prenuptial agreement before they tied the married. Jennifer was seen leaving the Whitman, a boutique condominium with views of Manhattan, on the day her marriage to Ben dissolved. She was returning to her hometown of New York City on her own, 